As CBS4 commemorates Haitian Heritage Month, we share an exhibit on display that showcases the history of our Little Haiti neighborhood. Little Haiti is one of the most diverse communities in South Florida. For decades, its culture and influence has been woven into the fabric of our community. CBS4 News anchor Keith Jones has more. Line Creole means we are here. It's simple. We are here. Also here. The Haitian culture, history, and influence on full display in the design district. The NOLA exhibition walks us back in time. With this timeline, we were able to show all of Haiti's contributions to the world. Many contributions with which few are familiar. During the time of um, the Holocaust, um, Haiti actually opened their doors to Jewish people and helping them to escape the Holocaust. 500 Haitian troops actually volunteered themselves to fight in the American Revolution. And this boy here is actually Henry Christophe, who eventually became the first emperor of the north of Haiti. Quite often we see haunting depictions out of Haiti, such as earthquakes, political strife, violence. NOLA's curator, Ivenya Despagne, challenged artists from different generations to represent Haiti's natural resources, its natural beauty. As we have so many current artists now that are doing more contemporary works, um, conceptual work, work in film, um, sculptures. And this is a mural of Viste Juste and his wife Marie Juste. Uh, Viste was actually the founder of Little Haiti here in Miami. Other influences in the gallery, Haiti being the first black republic, its slave and humanitarian revolutions, its spirituality, including voodoo. A rich history celebrated every day. Ruth Barot Tamfi is an illustrator. This one here is called Transmission Stable. Her inspiration, her grandmother in the aftermath of an earthquake. My grandma had, had like brought a radio because, you know, not a lot of communication was happening where we're trying to figure out where our family members are and just trying to hear back. And everyone has a story to tell. And she kind of just represents that, like just you kind of visiting like a hometown friend that you actually kind of miss and you don't talk to, but you're happy to reconnect with again. Keith Jones, CBS 4 News. Guests can visit the exhibit at the Buick building on 2nd Avenue in the Miami Design District through May 28th. That's this Saturday.